Hi friends, welcome back to SQL with Ravi Martha. Today we'll see how to find employees whose salary is higher than their manager salary. So here the input table is having employee ID, employee name, salary and manager ID. And we want to find employees whose salary is greater than their manager salary. So in the table we have only manager ID but not the manager salary directly. So we just need to look up with the same table and derive the manager salary. So we want the output like this. Wherever the employee salary is higher than manager we just need to pick up those details. Let's see how to solve this problem. So here I have the employee table which we have seen on the slide. Now let's understand how to derive this query. To understand this, this is the employee table and we want just replicate the table once. For the employee, the salary is given in the table. So we don't need to derive anything for this. However, we don't have the manager salary for that particular employee. So for that, what we need to do is we have the manager ID. We just need to join on the employee ID. So we just need to join on the manager ID to the employee ID of the employee table. So the manager is an employee of the company. We can just join on this particular column. So here the manager ID 3 is joined with the employee ID and we can fetch the manager salary. So for the first record manager ID is 3. We can join on this column and get the salary. For the second record manager ID is 3 again so we can get the salary. So for the third record manager ID is 5, the manager ID 5 is joined with the employee ID and we can fetch the manager salary from here. And the third step is we can compare the salary of the employee manager salary. So when I query this table, so we have the employee salary, now we want to write a query, join the employee table with itself, I'm aliasing it as M and join on the manager ID of the employee join with the second table to look up the manager details. So we have the join condition now so which will give the employee and the manager details. So here we have the employee ID 1 and manager is 3 and we are getting the manager details as well using the second query. So let me query this e dot star comma m dot star So this gives the first one is the using the employee table where we are getting the employee details and the second table is giving the employee details. So here the manager is 3 and we got the details of manager 3 and here we got the manager details of employee 5 and the first step is getting the salary using this particular query. Second step is getting the manager details using this particular self join. Now we need to compare the salary. We can write a where clause to compare the salaries. E dot salary is greater than the manager salary. Let's find the query now. So these are the three employees whose salary is greater than the manager salary. So let me find the query again. Here the employee D1, employee D3 and employee D4 are greater than the manager salary. Let's write the manager salary m dot salary. Let's write it as manager salary. So this is how we can easily get the manager salary and we can compare the salary of the employee and manager salary. So in this we have used the self join which means joining a table by itself. Hope you have liked this video. If you like my video, please subscribe to my channel. Thank you for listening. Have a great day.